Tonight, now, watch this car crash into a parked vehicle. Is a new exit ramp causing confusion and driving dangers? CBS 2's Dave Carlin reports. Somebody who's speeding off the exit. Hit your car. Hit my car. I'm just going over 50 miles an hour. Salvatore and Tosi's Chevy Aveo is a mangled total loss. CBS 2 with this exclusive video of the moment his car parked on Milford Drive was pushed into a telephone pole. Look again, slower this time, the driver exiting Staten Island Expressway on recently opened exit 13 christened it with a crash, taking off on foot. Intosi blames the driver, but also the State Department of Transportation. The problem is the new exit that wasn't there. Since that crash on August 29th, he counts five more with different drivers on or very near the same spot. It's six different accidents. People are flying off the exit. When the exit opened in mid-August, there were no street markings confusing drivers. Plus this, Chopper 2 shows how the expressway, Ocean Terrace, and Whitman Place all funnel onto Milford Drive. And from Whitman, we saw car after car, even school safety agents ignoring the stop sign in a hurry to merge. Neighbors say because the stop signs simply aren't working, they want traffic lights. The traffic light and also a camera. Yeah. They take a picture of the car and, get, and they get tickets. They will stop. It will stop that. A State Department of Transportation source tells CBS2 there will be an investigation. Neighbors demand it result in a slowdown or... Shut it down. They say something before the congested chaos causes death. In Emerson Hill, Staten Island, Dave Carlin, CBS2 News.